Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Artus. In this video, I'll be showing you how to remove Bing from Windows 11 Start, Search, Taskbar, and Microsoft Edge. But before we start, hurry up and check out these offers just under this video. Let's get started. So you might be wondering, how to exactly remove Bing from your Windows 11? Whether it's your Start, Search, or Taskbar, or Microsoft Edge here. Well, it's very easy. So first things first, if you do see Bing in your, uh, in this case, your taskbar here, what you could just do is you just need to right click on it and just click on unpin from taskbar to remove that. So yeah, another thing that you may want to do is whenever you try searching for something, sometimes you may notice that, hey, Bing shows up a lot in your uh, section here. So it takes up a lot of space. How do you change that? Well, all you need to do is you want to open up settings here. So just type in settings, open it up. You want to go to your website here, you want to open up privacy and secure, uh, security, and you want to scroll down a bit here, and you want to look for the option for searching Windows. Now, from here, I uh, sorry, let's go back here, and we want to search for search permissions instead. So let's go open it up. And what you need to do is you want to go ahead and look for the options here for cloud content search. Now, what you need to do is you just need to disable these two options here. And you want to scroll down a bit and you want to look for the more settings here that should show show search highlights now you want to go ahead and disable that as well now next is you want to go back one page here and you want to look for general here click on it and you want to disable anything that you see here so let's go ahead and click on it each and once we've done that what we need to do is we just need to close settings here now next is you want to go ahead and open up microsoft edge you want to go to the top right here click on the three dotted option and you want to go to settings. Now on their settings, what we need to do is you want to go to privacy and search services. And from here, you want to go ahead and look for the manage search, edge search, connect experience and services. And what you need to do is you want to go and disable a few things here. So you want to go to address bar and search, go ahead and search for search engine use in address bar. So instead of using Bing here, you may want to use another one, either Yahoo, Google or DuckDuckGo. So go ahead and choose the appropriate ones. For example, we have Google. Now you could also manage your search engines here if you want. So you can go and click on it and you can go and just delete any search engine that you don't want to use here. Now, yeah. So in this case, since we've selected Google here, so whenever you search something on Edge, Google will be used as your search engine. Now to totally disable Bing here in your PC, what you need to do is you just need to go to registry editor here, registry editor. Let's go open it up. Now worries can this can be kind of intimidating, especially if you're seeing a bunch of things like you're not familiar with. But what you need to do is you want to open up some folders. Now you want to expand HK local machine. You want to go ahead and expand software. And from here, you want to look for policies. So just scroll down a bit to so see policies here, expand it and you want to expand up Microsoft. Now from here, we want to go a key that is ready to mic uh to uh in this case Bing. So what you need to do is if you don't see it, you we need to right click on it and you want to choose new and just choose key here. And what we need to do is we want to name this to a very specific key. So you want to name your key here as Edge. So let's go ahead and just rename this. Let's name it as Edge. So make sure it's in the proper case here. And inside of it, what we need to do is we want to change this. So so in this case, you just go and right click on the empty space here, click on new and you want to choose the word 32 bit value here. And from here, what we need to do is we need to name this as hubs sidebar enable. Now, by the way, uh, let's go and just make sure we have it in the correct uh, case here. So hubs sidebar enable. Now, what you need to do is you want to make sure that it's set to zero. So by default, it's going to be set to zero. So you could go ahead and just, uh, in this case, select this one, right click on it. You could go ahead and modify this, just make sure it's set to zero. But if it's, again, it's by default, so it's going to be set to zero. So it's okay. You could go ahead and click on okay here. Now, once you've set this up, what you, you know, what you notice here is whenever you have or open up a sidebar for edge that contains Bing, you will never or you will not be able to see that again. But yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So, if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.